Arsenal Fan TV, Chris, what a performance tonight. What a performance. Well, I have to say, I'm, I'm gutted. I only came to see Abue tonight, and he wasn't even in, on the bench. Right? I paid good money for this. Uh, I'm going to ask for a refund. But. Well, you must have been impressed to see Danny Welbeck. What a performance by him. I mean, he, he could have had more than three. That guy scored a hat-trick. I mean, mm. LVG um, was saying when he left Man United, he wasn't good enough for them. He's going to be eating his words, mm. to, if not already. I mean... Welbeck scored more goals than Van Persie and Falcao combined so far. I mean, Falcao looks like the next Diego Forlan from what I've seen. At the moment. I know it's still early days, but <laughs> bit early, bit early. But no, but there's so much mm. to like about Welbeck. I mean, mm. firstly, 16 million was a snip. I mean, mm. and now he's probably worth double that. Mm. He's and, in- do you, and do you know what? If, interestingly, and again, it's early, but comparisons. A lot of people were saying we should have went and got Balotelli. Mm. I see Liverpool have lost away tonight and Welbeck produces the goods in this Champions League. Do you think that we definitely made the right move in getting um, you know, Welbeck instead of Balotelli? Well, that was the good thing about Welbeck. I mean, he's already got this premiership experience. Yeah. He's played in big games in the Champions League and even for England as well. And so he's, used, he's integrated straight away into our club as, as far as I'm concerned. Mm. He, uh, and I said he's English, so he, we've got an English core now, so he's obviously fitted in well with the lads. And I think he's a really nice guy as well, from what mm. I've heard. I mean, I don't, I've never met him, but mm. he seems like a lovely character and he's really popular with the Man United fans. And mm. I just think he's going to be a great asset to this club. And mm. he's probably our most important player now because... I think it was actually a blessing in disguise in some ways that Giroud got injured. We would never have got Welbeck if mm. he didn't get injured. So, I mean, everything happens for a reason at the end of the day. Get the Arsenal Fan TV app, available on Apple and Android now.